So if you look at it, relapsing and remitting is your most common type. Now, after you understood both of this, let's go into the traditional picture of presentation of MS patients. What is your classic type? There's three important types you need to know. Your classic MS patients are going to have time and space, right? So you're going to have something we call as relapsing and remitting. So if you look at it, relapsing and remitting is your most common type. Okay, so you'll have symptoms, right? You'll have neurologic deficit, right? Say the patient has some form of neurologic deficit, okay? And then the neurologic deficit improves with time because you're going to remyelinate or whatever, right? Once you remyelinate, the symptoms improve. They're like, oh yeah, I was weak on one side, but it's getting better now, but not fully better. So they will find a new baseline. They will find a new baseline with some residual weakness. And then what happens? They have another episode, right? They have another episode, which takes them even higher. So similarly, you'll have this relapsing, remitting episode, but the important thing is, they won't completely resolve from their previous problem. They will have some level of deficit and it's going to keep worsening, 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 worsening. Sometimes, after a certain point, there's no more relapses and remissions. It's just a constant upward trajectory. What is that known as? Secondary, Secondary progressive MS. Where now you're not having a remission period. You're just bad, 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 non-stop. There's no remission period at all. That is known as secondary progressive MS. Number three is day one of presentation. The patient has symptoms, never has remission, keeps going progressively worse, right? Keeps getting progressively worse from the very beginning. This is known as primary progressive MS. And these are the three types you need to know.